Hello everyone and welcome back to Cult of the Lamb. In the last session we defeated the World 3, Area 3 big boss. The third major boss of the game, which just leaves the one area left and then whatever happens after that with the, uh, the main dude. Oh, someone, someone just threw up right here. That's unfortunate. Yoink. And it's very unfortunate. Okay, uh, so... I want to just get these things going. Uh, and then I realized that because I've got pretty much everything I need, I don't need to worry about, like, being here for the start of a day so that I can get a sermon in and stuff. Like, it doesn't actually matter if I get a sermon in anymore. So, I'm just not going to bother about that anymore. And everything will be fine. <laughs> Let's just get them going. Uh, we'll leave them a bit of food. Oops. And yeah, so if I just simply don't need to care about that anymore, then we can just go straight to the new area. Instead of waiting for day to roll around and doing all that stuff and everything. Hello, mate. Yes, you like? I find many of these tasty morsels. You're welcome, mate. You're free. Don't eat them all at once. <laughs> all right, the final area. The final area. Silk Cradle. 20% chance of healing when you kill someone. Rolling into an enemy will damage them with no cooldown. Damages everything on screen when hit. Gain an extra half a heart. Alright, that's fine. I keep forgetting to turn it off, but you know what? It's fine. I don't actually mind. Oh, I just realized. I start with all those hearts. Oh. I start with all those hearts because it's been multiple days. Huh. Huh. So if I want to make the game easier for myself, I just wait multiple days until I go on the run, and then I have multiple hearts from each day before? I see. I hadn't, I hadn't realized that was what was happening. So if the final boss is like super hard, then I can just like wait some days. Hmm. Did I not take any damage? I think I somehow didn't take any damage in that room. It felt like I was going to, so I'm not sure how I managed not to, but I'll take it. I will certainly take it. Okay, still haven't taken a hit. It's going well. It's going better than I was expecting, for sure. Well, I took a hit there.
Lovely. I'm getting more bones than normal from this run. That's for sure. That is for sure. Spider silk. That's that first spider silk drops that we've seen. Oh, you fucking piece of shit. That was not there when I rolled in the room and then suddenly appeared. That is some bullshit right there. Man, I'm getting insane amounts of bones from this joint. This is nuts. Silk Cradle. Okay. Uh, I think let's just take uh, the shortest route, I guess. Yeah, that works. by the rocks of the darkened sea at the foot of the long sudden drop. Within the moor of pointed teeth beasts, the stutter of the heart then stopped. He was the fifth, the fifth bishop of the old faith, our brother, the one who waits. Back then he was known by the name Narinda. But as millennia wore on, he grew discontent with his role. He began to question. He was gluttonous in his ambition. And in my imprudence, I loved him. For it, I lost my mind. For it, he lost his freedom. Can you fathom such betrayal, Lamb? Of your own turned against you? Would you like to find out? Uh-oh, uh-oh, is he going to turn my people into dissenters? He was the fifth. The fifth bishop of the old faith. Wait, you just said this. Solvix, leader, I'm sorry. Solvix, you piece of shit! Whoa! I have to kill Solvix? Sorry, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm so sorry. I thought he was just going to make him descend. I didn't think he was going to make me fucking kill him. Oh, Solvix. Shit. Mucho unfortunate.
so many skeletons. It's insane. I've got more bones on this one run than in any previous run. Like, this is crazy. Not bad. Here we go, boss time. Oh good, it's a spider. Folk folk halor. Got him! Got him! Give me that spider silk. Give me that fucking spider silk. Fucking give me that fucking spider silk. Holy shit, that's a lot of silk. Yeah, boy. Alright, adios, mate. Lumber, beetroot seeds, or gold nuggets? Uh, should we try some beetroot? Why not? Why not try some beetroot? There we go. First one down. Everything alright back at camp? Apart from the one dead guy. Oh, faith is low. Faith is very low. Let's fix that. Hunger is low and faith is low. You know what we do? We do the hunger ritual. Bing. Problem solved. You're welcome. Okay, 
Uh, we've got a new person. Alma. You are going to be... Jason. And yes, it is with an I. If anyone's thinking I misspelled it. No, that is how it's spelled. Welcome. Bunch of new forms. Wait, even more new forms? Oh, wow, yeah, ton down here. Jesus, yeah. Very nice, very nice. But you've come as a bunny, and you get faith when you fall ill. Sounds good. Welcome, Jason. Uh, go chop trees for me. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, 52, 47, 51. Okay. You guys have fun with that. Oh, we can get the final house! Yes! It is done! It is finally done. We did it! Homes for all. Oh, we've only got 11 people. We can have a 12th. Welcome, Fukalor. Uh, and by Fukalor, I of course mean... Noah! Welcome, Noah. 15% easier to level up. Loses five faith when anyone dies. Cool. Uh... You can refine shit. Bum, bum, bum. Shakalambaya. Oh, tasty meat. Hell yeah. empty again. Okay, go go gadget people. Do yo thang. is pretty good. That is pretty good. Um, let's go and uh, oh well first of all let's see if there's anything more to buy. Let's see. Let's go and buy everything we can because it is a new day. The last one. The last blueprint here. Good good. That's all of Darkwood collected. We love to see it. Then let's go to Spore Grotto. Carved the pumpkin. These are the last three here. Good, good. That's the final one for Anura. Uh, 
And we already bought all of those. Yep. So now off to here. Two blueprints, the crystal tree. And the crystal lamp. Lovely jubbly. And this dude isn't back over here, right? No. Now let's go check out the lonely shack. Because there are two people we need to be beat in knuckle bones. We lamb, glad you could make it. How about a match? Well, well, child, you finally you found your way here. Fancy a match? Be warned I play for keeps. Okay, Flinky is the next difficulty up. Let's see if we can do this. Ba -ba -ba -boom, ba -ba -ba -boom. Hmm? Why did you not match? You idiot! There we go. Oh, please roll a three. Oh, that would have been sick. If I could roll a three ever, that would be great. Never lucky. He has no sixes, does he? Motherfucker. Piece of shit. Uh, he does have double fours there, though. Ha ha! Ah, oh, the three. That's all we've been looking for. Nice score, dickhead. He didn't put it in the middle? You idiot. You fool. Wow, and he didn't put that on the right. GG, motherfucker. Sa, sa, sa. Wait, Flinky wins? Wait, what? How does Flinky win? What? I have so many more points than him. How does how does 6666 does not add up to 54? What? 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 When dice of the same number are placed in the same row, multiply them instead of... Oh, fuck me. That sucks. <laughs> oh, man, I feel like I just lost to bullshit. So it's a risk-reward thing. Because putting it in the same row is risky, because if they get one, they can just put it in the that row and delete everything you got, but... You can multiply if you do do it that way. I'm confused how multiplying them, like, it says if they're in the same column, then multiply them. Right. 
two times two, that's four. That's not eight. So like, what? That doesn't make any sense. Don't you dare roll a three. Okay, I should have this. I am in the lead and going first. I really should have this. Cool, I win. Suck it. Whew. What? I suppose you'd better take this. Hey, a tarot card, nice. Immune to poison. Cool, cool. It's a bad apple. Boy. And now let's do Plunko and Bop. He's smarter. He is definitely smarter. Do I really want to get rid of his one? Is the question. Like, one is not a good number to have. I guess I kind of want to have him keep his one. I'm surprised he didn't multiply his fives. That seems like a mistake. So as long as he doesn't roll six here, I win. Fuck yeah. If he rolled six, I would have been in absolute shambles. I first try the one that's supposed to be harder. Not bad, take this. I tried to win it back, but I don't think I can lose another hand. Blasted shroomy. Receive five fervor when hit. Okay, there's still a few more to unlock that we've never seen before. Hmm. There are still a few more. Cool. Well, that's good. It's been a while since we uh, came back here. We get a whopping 15 fervor from that now. Oh, yes. Big money balling. Falling out of control. It's night time, how's our little cult doing? You doing alright? Yeah, you're doing alright. Wait, why are you sleeping on the floor? Does he not have a bed? Noah. Uh, a sign. Noah, mate. That's weird that it, I feel like it should auto assign. Not sure what the benefit is to it not auto assigning. Has this been out of commission or something? Why has this not got anything in it? Okay. 
bum 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 Day 58. So many new things. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's make some food. You're welcome, everyone. Okay, and then... Let's head out on another conquest. Oh. 